Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the tutorial. I'm Sean. In today's tutorial, I will give you a very neat example to how to write the publisher the subscriber in C++. So let's go to the uh, 11 section. Writing a simple publisher subscriber, and scrolling down, and you can see that in this sample code, we uh, knows that the the messages we're gonna use today is the standard messages string. So the very first thing, first thing we're gonna do is to check the messages to know what is inside this. And so we just uh, Rust show Rust standard message string, and you will see that there's only one parameter in here, and the type is string, and the name is the data. So here we need you guys to do two things that you need to. Uh, you need to generate the two new files. The first file is named talker.cpp and another one is listener.cpp. I'm gonna write in the publisher in the talker and the subscriber in the listener. So let's open the uh, our IDE. I'm gonna I'm here I'm gonna use the Qt creator. You can use the anything you want it. Uh, you can or you can just use the text editor. It's the it's the same. So the first code we're gonna write here is to uh, import the header file. So the raw slash raw and the standard messages strings and this one a string is going to help us to generate the messages. And then we need to write down our main method over here. Okay, well there's a couple important things we need to write on first, which is the raw methods. Uh, the first one is the Rust init, which we need to uh, in get input our name of our nodes in here, and we need to instantiate our node object, the node handle object, and the publisher. The publisher is generated by the method of the the node handle, which is the node handle dot advice advertise uh, standard message string, which the, in this is the uh, the messages we're gonna use and in the parentheses here is the topic name and after that is the maximum buffer we're gonna uh, to store our publisher but you can just put any number you would like and after that is the ROS rate which we need to specify the uh, how many times we're gonna publish our messages in the second here is 10 hertz so after we're doing the, all of this preparation, uh, we need to write something to build our messages. So here uh, we need to write on the while loop and here is the Rust OK. It's the method to check our system is working. And here we need to build our Rust message object and we put some string in it. We use, just use the string thing to, gen, uh, to generate some string. And we use count to you know increasing each loop and just to, just to check the uh, our system is is working can you, and you can see that the number is increasing and we put that string into our Rust messages and you will see here we have checked this message before there is only parameter the name is data type type of string so we just put these things into the data and after that. Uh, we go, we're gonna just you know point out these messages to the terminal just for checking and there's a very important thing here is that you know this one is the publisher we generated before and we use the publish method to publish the messages and after that there is a ROS spin once which is a very useful method for the uh, for the publisher to communicate with the subscriber so we need so it's, it's, it's called we have to write it down and this is the loop rate sleep method, which is uh, you know to corresponding to the this method to telling the system which part we're gonna sleep and until the next time I'm gonna publish the message. So let's see uh, the very very example about the the publisher. So uh, this goes through the uh, the subscriber. The subscriber is the much easier to write. And the very first thing is the same. We need to include in our header file, and we need to write our main method. 
And after that, there is uh, also some preparation for our subscriber. We need to also need to ignite our notes, which the name is the listener. And we need the note handle, and we need to build our subscriber. And we knew, we use the note handle dot subscribe, the top name, the maximum, you know, the messages. And we need to put the callback function over here. And we need to uh, write down the ROS spin, which is, you know, corresponding to the ROS spin once in the uh, our publisher's code. And so, what about this chapter callback function? This callback function is the, what we gonna, what I'm gonna do it when I, you know, when I just subscribe in a message from the topic. Well, here is the callback function over here, and you have to write down this, and you just put your, uh, uh put your arguments must be the uh, the messages we you're gonna uh listening, and here in the code I just. It output the uh, the things I heard it from the topic, and I yeah just doing that, and that's very simple. That's the very simple listener over here. So let's start to check that if I'm doing everything right, and how and we can see how the publisher and subscriber works. So here, if you remember that there is a very uh, important command over here is the cat key made because every time you fix your code you have to run a cat make cat make and here we're gonna I'm gonna use the ROS core and ROS run to run our nodes the first node is the publisher and the second node is the subscriber so here ROS node a uh, ROS score well very good. And here we're gonna roll use the Ross Run beginner tutorial talk part. And you will see that the the, the message is in you know, updating and print out on the terminal. And it is opening another terminal and run a code, the Ross Run beginner tutorial listener. So here you can also see that I heard hello world uh 200 blah blah so that's the messages i grab from the topic and then the, and that message is published from his publisher so that's the very simple publisher and subscriber in c++ well thanks for watching this video if you like this tutorial series please subscribe and hit the like button below and in the next tutorial, I will give you another example about a publisher and a subscriber. And I will see you guys in the next tutorial. Peace.